Texas Governor Craig Abbott announcing an executive order today. All bars must close and restaurants are bumped back down to 50% capacity from 75. Fox 44's Cameron Stewart, he talked to some local bar and restaurant owners earlier today. He joins us now in the studio. Cameron, how are they taking this news? Adam, after being open just over a month, bars were forced to close their doors by noon today. Safe to say some owners felt like they had the rug pulled out from under them. I was surprised. Bars all around Texas shutting their doors today with almost no warning. This morning, Governor Greg Abbott announced an executive order forcing all bars to close at noon today and for all restaurants to go back down to 50% capacity. Employees left stunned. With like all the rules in place, I figured like they probably wouldn't shut down, but after I got the news this morning, it was kind of a little bit shocking. We're a little disappointed that we have to close down again. For local favorites like George's Restaurant, being limited to 50% capacity again is a change they almost made themselves. They say safety in the restaurant comes first. Whenever we first transitioned into the 75%, we almost stayed at 50% because of our social distancing, the ta tables being six feet apart still. Uh, so we tried to maintain that and maintain the integrity of our guests and the safety of our guests for that. The Dancing Bear Pub didn't need Governor Abbott to tell them to pull back the doors. They saw the writing on the wall and closed indefinitely yesterday. Aside from slow business, they had more important reasons. What, what is it worth? Like uh, most of my employees have kids, younger kids, um, including myself. Uh, I have a grandson that lives with us. Um, so, you know, thinking about our own families and taking it home was a big, big, uh, big part of that decision. The number of positive COVID-19 cases has been climbing in Texas since the reopening, with McLennan County on pace to set a new high for cases for a third week in a row. It could be up to the people to determine when these nights out will be safe again. It'll probably get better sooner rather than later, if, as long as people are following the rules and actually taking it seriously. <laughs> the governor did not announce a reopen date. Live in the studio, I'm Cameron Stewart, Fox 44 News.